build you an engine, 85 more horsepower. Could install a suspension, keep you low to the ground, make you handle like you're on rails. Gonna give you a symmetrical bumper that'll cut through the air like a bullet. Gonna get you primed, painted, and striped. Be ready for Carlisle. Hear me? Perfect. Amos is putting the wheels on right now in the front. We're gonna lower the car down and just triple check that nothing's gonna rub through here because we don't want to paint the car and have that be an issue later, obviously. So one final check here. The rear reno is good, but the front, I am pretty confident in it, but it's always best to check it twice. And at least once even. <laughs> All right, so it is Sunday morning. We were here last night to like 10.30 or so, just getting the car into the paint booth, doing any final prep work we needed to do, taping it up, cleaning it up, getting it ready to spray this morning. Whew. Tony's over here cleaning up the last of the bumper extensions and the last pieces that need clean. That's not a white flag, I was just waving high. <laughs> it's also no a white flag. No surrender, no surrender. No surrender, he says, that's right. So anyway, we are just about ready to spray. So we're gonna lay some sealer down, then we're gonna lay our base coat, and then after that, we're gonna let it flash for a little while, and then we're gonna be doing some complex line work. Tony, why do we do this to ourselves? For you guys. Oh wait, and because we love to do this and this car. <laughs> Something like that. Yeah, yes. Oh, we do it for a lot of reasons, I suppose. Right, yes. Anyway, we're excited because we are finally because putting we paint. we don't think about it too hard. That too, we don't think about it too hard. That, that's the best part. That, 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 that's the real answer, we don't think about it too hard. And anyway, we were excited because we were finally getting this thing into paint. It's been a long time coming and we are very happy with how it sits right now. So anyway, we're gonna just go ahead and get this thing coated and then we'll show our process for doing the line work and everything else. All these pints and not a single one's what I need. I don't know, I'm the one looking, you know I'm terrible about that. Yeah, I don't need them either. The problem is I see something that's cool and then I completely forget what I'm looking for for three seconds. <laughs> there might be a can in there. There's some cans. All right, that's not it. This is gross. Ah! 
so we ran an issue, as you saw with Tony kicking a can across the parking lot. Um, we use the Glazer Universal Primer, which can be also mixed as a sealer, like most primers can be. And it's kind of like a cocktail to make that work. You need, uh, you need your, uh, your tint and your binder to make it work. And we thought we had enough. Well, apparently it was not enough. So after searching for frantically for what, 20 minutes or so, we're kind Something of giving like everything. That. Yeah. So I guess instead we're gonna prep some other parts for paint a while and paint it tomorrow. And actually Brandon might even swing by tomorrow. So that'd be a bonus, I guess. Bonus! Yay! Give you a sneak peek of our colors here. They're not mixed right now, so it's not gonna look entirely right, but we got our red. It's gonna be to match the wheels. You can see in the center it's a little separated, but whatever. And then we got our dark blue. And last but not least, you ready for this one? Look at that. <laughs> They'll look way better when I mix them up later. Let me spray the lines on. Oh, I guess flat, we should also mention the, the, the final color, which is the base that will be the uh, canvas for our work today. Hot pink. <laughs> Tony wouldn't let me go with uh, pink either, so. It's separated, but you can get an idea. Oh man, I'm so excited. Today's gonna be a good day. We're gonna be confident, gonna spray well. And I got, actually, I've gotten a lot of comments lately of people like, oh, the paint is right. I'm so excited to paint this. You guys can take a break. I'm painting! <laughs> <laughs> Look what I got. Got our toner finally. A little bit behind schedule, but it's okay. We're ready. Eat my lunch, and I'm spraying. And we also got some extra filler to, to mix as sealer, because the other can was low anyway. I'm just gonna spray the new stuff. Done that guy. That doesn't use the old stuff first. And we got a hardener. Finally, it's time. After I eat my mac and cheese, like an adult. Space. <laughs> one small step for man, one giant leap for me. <laughs> Technoperlite for those wondering. I love this gun. You can bleep that out. <laughs> So we're gonna be using what's called base coat hardener, which is kind of the backwards or the opposite of what you expect it to do. Typically, if you spray like diamond base, I believe it's like four hours-ish that you have it to be open so you can then lay more base on top or clear whatever you wanna do. This will allow it to be open for 24 hours. So this will give us more time to do the complex tape lines that we wanna do that you're gonna see very soon, which I'm very excited for. So I need to pick a different, a different uh, adjective than excited. <laughs> I am stoked for it. <laughs> you can bleep that one out too. <laughs> Mix it up real good so it's consistent. 
Because we're painting the body and stuff now so we can do the line work. But we still have other parts to paint and we really need them all to be consistent. We're a little nervous about it. We don't have enough room in the, ba the, the booth to uh, do them all at once. Unless I sprayed them outside here and that's legal, so. Marmalade grass bit, I hate this so much. <laughs> I'm going to pour this all over myself. Uh, yeah, I feel like I should. You're good. If I make a mess, I'm making a mess. Pick a cup up or something. Wow, look at that. A master. And then this gets mixed one to 75%. I double check my notes. Yeah, one to 75%. Now I just do the math. None of you hasn't been here yet, so I'm, just, I'm, I'm doing this math on my own. This is scary. But Logan's double checking me, so let's do it. <laughs> So the car is now in base. As you can see, it's this fine, nice matte gray finish, which will be glossy at the end when we clear it. But now it's time to spend a lot of time doing fine line taping, right, Tony? Correct. Yeah, it's gonna a be lot a lot of time. You said a, that, yeah. A lot of time. Lot it is time. currently what 8:30? Ish. 8:30 ish on Monday night. We have many hours ahead of us, I believe. Probably a lot more than I can imagine, anyway. More than um, we want to imagine. Yes, of uh, laying a pattern down <laughs> here. So we're gonna use our fine line tape, we're gonna lay our pattern out that we'd like on this side, then we're gonna do everything in our power to mirror it for the other side. You ready? I am. I'm ready to stop talking about what we do it. We can keep talking while we do it, I guess. <laughs> yeah, let's get it. Yeah, yeah. The fender, right? So tell, tell me what you're thinking first. I'm thinking keep it fairly wide and let it taper. Just follow the shape of the fender there. Mm -hmm. And then here, have it dive off. Yeah, have it dive off. Do we want to have it? Question. So we have three lines, right? We forgot to put the each line. We're still, we're good. It didn't harden in there. Yeah, the tip's not even frozen. Yeah, uh, we're good. Last night wasn't that Base long is nice. ago, so. Yeah. <laughs> it wasn't 
True. It actually wasn't that last night. It was this morning. It was this morning. All right, so it's Tuesday night, it's nine o'clock. We had anticipated, you know, having the car cleared this morning, I think. About there, sometime like mid-morning or whatever. It's nine o'clock, we're about to play some clear down. Now, Logan is, you know, our videographer, photographer, editor. Uh, I don't want him in the booth when I spray because when you spray clear, it goes everywhere, it's super sticky, and we don't have windows to look in, but otherwise you'll see the outcome shortly. Yeah. Yeah. I'm tired. <laughs> Do I look tired? He, he looks tired. Look at that guy. I definitely look tired. <laughs> Not I mean, as tired as I, you guys probably are, though. That's true. We hide it well. That's how bad, that's how tired we are. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to even want to mention how much I have not slept in the past two weeks. No. No. <laughs> it's we, worth it, though. We spent a lot of time today in the past couple hours. We thought we were going to clear a couple hours ago. We spent time just kind of nitpicking things we didn't like and correcting some lines and little like fuzzy edges and whatnot that we didn't just too glaring so yeah we don't cut corners here we were in a rush and i know actually i got a lot of messages from people saying like oh don't rush it don't rush it don't cut corners to get done time we're not cutting corners we're doing exactly how we want it to be we're not really rushing either we're just no putting a lot of hours in sure, yeah silver lake sent us these uh titanium wheel studs these are titanium, they're PVD coated. Freaking sweet. It is now Wednesday, which is the day this video is coming out. This is this is all we're we've been doing all this in real time. You know, typically YouTubers will do a video and they'll make it the content like months in advance. This is all in real time. Now, I don't know moving forward how real time everything we will do will be because we are busy people also trying to do customer work alongside all of this. But I love it. We just pushed it out now. We do just, you have emotion? We just, we just painted it last night. We, you, it, it's still curing. <laughs> we need to check in though. Tony. Yes. What emotions are you feeling right now? Um, a couple of days ago, I felt a twinge of excitement. <laughs> that, that's something. Yeah. <laughs> this man is dead yes. inside. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. Yes. Anyway, thanks for watching. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and also, if you think you know what we what movie we ripped the intro from and made a spin-off of, 
Drop it in the comments below. We're gonna select one lucky winner to send them something that's related to Crucible Coachworks. Anyway, see you guys Saturday. Not only are we releasing a video Saturday, I guess, but also we'll be at the swap meet on Saturday. So make yep. sure you come out to the PCA annual swap meet in Carlisle, Pennsylvania, and check out, try to find our booth. We're gonna be, what, pretty much center, right? <laughs> yeah, we'll be in the sponsorship area. Yeah, we'll be in the sponsorship area. Look for the Translog slash Crucible Coachworks booth. Come say hi, get a photo with us. We'll sign your forehead. I don't know. I'd do that. I'd do that. I'll <laughs> sign I'll sign your forehead. Anyway, catch you guys on Saturday in both the person, in person and online. I'm gonna get this car done, right Tony? Yeah.